Grass. And welcome to Kids Crafts by, by three, three sisters. sisters. Today we are showing you guys how to make Stimpy Ghost. And we're dedicating this craft to our Aunt Mia because she's been telling us to do this craft for quite a long time. And we found a tutorial online by Kathy and Steve and we thought that we had to try it. Before we show you guys how to make Stiffy Ghost, make sure to hit that red subscribe button and click the thumbs up. Good job, Ghost. And make sure to hit the notification bell. Now on to the video. The things we'll be needing to make Stiffy Ghost are one balloon, one glass jar, scissors, one bowl, two pieces of cheesecloth, cut 24 inches a piece. We had a hard time finding our cheesecloth, but ho thankfully Hobby Lobby had it in the fabric section. Stiffy Mod Podge, tin foil, and two black ovals out of ki black construction paper. And, and one, one hot glue gun. gun. So, so let's get started. The first step is to construct your ghost. We are going to be using the balloon as the head, the tin foil as the arms, and the, the jar and the bucket to help shape it, the body together. So what you're going to do is roll up your tin foil, just like that, and then you're going to come over to your jar. So you're going to place it right here, and you can really make any shape you want your arms. I'm going to shape it here, and you can shape it however you want. You can have straight arms, they can be wavy. It's your choice. The next step is to blow up your balloon about need shape of a head. So I'm going to stop about there and tie my balloon. If you don't know how to tie a balloon, you take your string of the balloon, you take two fingers, and then wrap the balloon underneath. And then I'm just going to stick it right there. We're tired of our balloons jumping around, so we're just deciding to tape them. I'm going to tape it onto the jar. And don't really move it around or else you'll pop your balloon. 